my name is Alexis and in today's video I'm just simply going to be doing a QA. and a If you're watching this video at the time and day I'm uploading this, I'm currently meeting Miranda Sings right now. Like literally, like I'm staring her right in the face as you're watching this. You don't deserve it. Yes, I'm currently meeting Colleen Ballinger and seeing Miranda Sings in concert again. If you remember in 2018, I did see her and I will link that video somewhere here. So on Monday, you'll be seeing the vlog of that. I'm vlogging everything about that day because I'm actually traveling out of town for it. But yeah, I'm really excited. Hopefully I don't look like Rachel the big fat white nasty smell and fat when I meet her again because this is, just, this is just sad. So I really didn't have enough time to put a good video together and edit it with my week schedule. So I just thought I would do a Q&A, which by the way, if Thank you guys so much for sending me so many questions. I didn't think anybody would literally send me any. You guys sent me so many good ones and I'm going to be answering as many as I can today um, before I uh, my pants because I, I just do that sometimes. And then also I'm gonna do Daisy's eyebrows. Just like, please get the off me. My eyebrows literally make me wanna do do my dive beer right now. Like what the that. Before we get started, if you want to see any more content from me or enjoy this video and you found me somewhere, please hit that subscribe button. It really helps my channel out. And yeah, without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> Oh, great my computer's updating right when i'm trying to film great <laughs> all right so the first question comes from Daniel rp on instagram and they ask are you into musical theater and if so what musicals i've never understood musicals but my best friend in the whole wide world kelsey she always did hi kelsey love you she's into phantom les mis uh wicked i think aladdin I don't know, but she always talked about musical theater to me and it's always intrigued me. And also on Instagram on my Explore page, I always got ads for Beetlejuice on Broadway. Definitely caught my interest. I ended up watching it and that is my favorite musical and the only musical I've seen in my life that is Broadway based. I love it so much. I have the soundtrack saved. I understand why Kelsey raves about it. Literally when I got the news that it is closing in June, I started bawling my eyes out. Hopefully I can go see it in person someday, get a signed playbill, get a playbill from it someday. I will figure it out. Julia asks, where would you like to travel to? I always say Paris whenever people ask me this question because if you didn't know, I'm always obsessed with Paris. I guess my next one would be New York because of the Broadway shows and also I have friends up there that I wanna see as well as being able to say I've been in New York, Times Square. Hey, Emily. Hey. <laughs> Which is also on my bucket list to visit New York. I need to get rid of this eyebrow pin. And also just to be there at like New Year's Eve. I need to like plan a trip there someday and get out of my house. G Wonderland asks, how are you today? I'm good. I had some nasty dinner. <laughs> Me and Emily have been craving this pizza place for weeks. And then we finally went there tonight. Nasty <laughs> the second time. We went to Baskin Robbins. I went to work today and now i'm here about to get ready to um go find miranda singer i'm just like <laughs> garrett asked rate each escape the night seasons characters to best to worst i guess i'll just say the best one season one had to be I guess I would say Ollie was really good in season one. He's very smart. Obviously, he escaped. Season two, the best were obviously Tyler Ugly, Andrea Russet. Season three was like hands down the second best cast besides season four. But it was Sophia, Colleen, Nikita, Manny, you, you know the deal. Season four, obviously, I was rooting for people like Colleen and Bretman. Multi Daniel asked, who is your favorite TikToker? I send like 99 to over 100 TikToks to everybody every single day. And they're probably from multiple different people. But I do have a bunch that I do follow that are my favorites. I don't have just one. I have a list here and I'm gonna, I'm just gonna fire them off as fast as I can. Ready? Here we go. Orchid, Bondi Walkers, Ava Lay, Kayla Finn, Lauren Blush, Abby Art Artistry, Mythicality, Sevi John, A Few Blending Brushes, Morgan Drinks Coffee, Charlotte Looks, Uwu Thotty, Mandy, aka Bees Knees, Lay Bins, Love Leo, Infernum Asylum, Clap Daddy, Brittany Broski, and Foxberry Cosplay. I think that's all of them. I used to hate TikTok and I'm so glad I got into like downloading the app because literally any of my friends can testify you probably wake up to about 200 of them in your dms kelsey asks what is your favorite song right now my favorite song right now is opal by freddie dread aka it is a 
freaking TikTok song. Utterly Etn asked favorite Escape the Night episode. My favorite episode has to be season four when all the girls were trying to like seduce the emperor. Gabby asked, what is your favorite all time movie? It is definitely Wreck-It Ralph. I know it's so childish. I have no joke seen that movie 16 times, I think. Whenever I would get bored, my grandma would just take me to the movie theaters when it was there and I would, I can like literally recite the whole movie because I, I just love it. Funny thing is when the second movie came out um, at my movie theater, they had a giant like poster in the main lobby area. I literally called up there and asked if I could have it. <laughs> Victoria asked, do you have any predictions for the book Joey is working on? Currently, I think it has something to do with witches or spells or magic because of the Instagram story I posted a couple weeks ago. Talked about he wanted to write a book like that. Or it might be something like kind of sci-fi-ish. Again, like um, this lovely series right here. So freaking excited and I just, I, I, I like, I like read. I am reader. If you could join any season of Skip the Night, which would it be and why? I would definitely do season three. I just love everyone that's in there and I love like carnivals and amusement parks so I feel like I could literally just I, I, I'd be escaping the night if I didn't end up having a panic attack. I just feel like if I was in season four I would have a big target on my back like Bretman did. Zach asked are you looking forward to season five of Escape the Night and if so who do you want in it? I made a video of who I want in my dream cast or aka season five cast any cast really I will link that up here wherever the little thing is. I am looking forward to it I'm really excited to hop back into reacting to like the cast reveal recapping the episodes. I know a lot of people who couldn't get YouTube Red really enjoyed those. Definitely going to be making those again. I'm really happy I miss making those videos so much and just having that interaction. It was so much fun. I've been looking into every conspiracy theory. I've been looking for any sign that Joey is filming except tonight. So... We just, we just gotta pray. When are you filming a video with your mom? I'm filming a video with my mom at the end of the month. It'll be coming out the week of the 27th. Really excited, she really loves you guys, especially with that live stream that we did and you guys are interacting with her. Giggly, <laughs> come here baby. My kitty's here. Oh my goodness. Hi baby, you wanna say hello? People say their owners look like their pets. Is that true? Emily asks, what was the reason for you to start YouTube? Wow, 10 out of 10. I mainly wanted to start YouTube to make others laugh and smile and just feel like they're really accepted for who they are. And just as well as I use YouTube as an outlet for my weirdness that I never got to let out when I was a kid because people are mean. And this turned into a passion of just video making and wanting to document everything. The process of editing and uploading is one of my favorite things ever. Have you taken the MBTI test? If not, then I'll give you five seconds to look it up and take it. Oh my God, uh, MBTI test. <laughs> Wait, one second, let me take this test. Okay, I just finished the test and it's saying my biggest personality type is judging. Oh, oh, so organized, systematic, achievement, oriented planner. Yeah, that's true. As a fellow 19 year old, I would like to hear your opinion about high school, college, and education in general. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna go in quick bullet points because I've talked about this before, but slightly. Any amount of education is acceptable. Getting a GED is acceptable. Going to college is acceptable. Everything's optional. Don't let any number test any opinion of a teacher anything that the school tells you that you are that is negative don't let it define you i can promise you in high school i was very very strict on myself i always wanted honor roll i wanted the best grades ever and i was it was very mentally damaging when i did that to myself and looking back on it i am so upset that i just didn't take the time to realize like uh, 79 on a test isn't gonna ruin my life like nobody at a workplace is gonna be like well you got a 46 on your Spanish test so maybe you're not good at retail if you want to drop out whatever works best for you there's no judgment with it whatever works best for you you don't have to go to college I'm 19 and I, I don't have plans for college because well I'm sitting here talking to a camera but that's not the point basically do whatever you think is best for yourself whatever mentally because that is gonna help you in the long run I promise all right that was all the questions I'm sorry this video was a piece of baloney again I will have a much better video coming out Monday where I meet Miranda but yeah thank you guys so much for watching if you like this video and you want to see more content from me please hit that like and subscribe button Ow. also you can leave me future video recommendations in the comment section below one last thing if you'd like to be notified whenever i upload please hit that bell button next to the subscription button wait yeah that way you'll see my face in your subscription box i can't 
freaking breeze. My social medias are linked down below. And yeah, thank you for taking a vacation to me and my chaplet paradise. I hope to see you soon. Bye.